So Dixie's been to Arizona with Noah. So this was his first time coming into the East Coast. And what do you think his biggest, like, what he was like, oh, my God, this is wild. Uh, well, I'm going to, I think I already know how green it was. Yes. Yeah. Is that and you didn't, I, you don't realize how green it is in Connecticut, like especially summertime, winter, mm-hmm. it's. It's not, but just driving around and looking. It's so like, lush. Oh my God. Yeah. It was just, that's so, it was that's funny for like a 20 year old to like notice that. That's funny. Yeah. But it's, it was, so it was, it was strange. That's, that's how of a big, how much of a big deal it is for a 20 year old to re- notice that. I think. Don't yeah. you think? It was, it was, it was strange, but really cool. I mean, it was great. I just got to see a lot of my friends. I brought a bunch of guys up to Mohegan Sun. We did a weekend there. I saw my buddy Rick O'Neill, who was, had uh, have anybody seen on on Instagram or, or Facebook? He's had some bad health issues, and I went to his house and got to see my mom. My mom just had knee surgery, so there was all I was running around a lot. But it was raining, and then the last day, Monday, Noah's family was in town, and they went into New York City. So, and Dixie's been into New York City a bunch of times. So she, they drove into New York City, and I stayed in Connecticut, and they. Apparently had a blast and rode the subway and I was and so fun. Yeah, <laughs> that's great. Yeah. I was yeah, really was, worried about her being there. I don't, I, I don't know if I said that. You did. <laughs> you mentioned to me. I don't know about her going. <laughs> yeah, she said there were a lot of people coming up to them, which was fun. But they had fun, and that was uh, Noah's first time in New York City. Yeah, he had a lot of firsts. 